Okay, we'll go next to Chelsea Goad from Space.com. Hi, Bob and Doug. Thank you so much for taking my question. Um, so I actually have a quick question about the manual control of the spacecraft. Um, there is the possibility that you will have to assume some manual control. And I'm curious kind of what you've trained for and what you are expecting just in case something happens and, and, and what you can look forward to and what you guys are ready to do. With that one. I think uh, the Dragon spacecraft ha does have a lot of capabilities for us to intervene manually. I think probably the one that uh, most folks are uh, uh, the most familiar with is actually the possibility to take over and manually fly the vehicle potentially close to space station. Uh, folks probably know that's how we got the space shuttle uh, docked to the International Space Station. Uh, we took over manually and flew those final steps of the mission. But we do have a series of uh, manual capabilities that allow us to uh, really protect ourselves if the automation was to have some sort of a problem with it, less of a focus on executing the mission with, uh, with the manual controls. Uh, Doug should have the opportunity a couple of times during the flight to manually fly the vehicle with those interfaces that, uh, that kind of drive it around. Um, but we will be uh, probably checking out some of the other manual interfaces that, that we're involved with as well. Doug, I, you have anything to add? Yeah, just as Bob mentioned, you know, we specifically, uh, as part of this test flight, designed in some time with, uh, you know, in the pre-flight phase as well as uh, closer to space station so we can test out actual manual flying capability of the vehicle and just to see and verify that it handles the way we expect it to and the way the simulator shows it to fly. And uh, I think it's a, it's a prudent part of our flight test, just like anything else, in case the eventuality happened for a future crew that needed to take over manually and fly the spacecraft. So we're just doing our part to kind of test out all the different capabilities of Crew Dragon. 